Ron, it's Ted. Today we're at Amy Beal High School. We're here with several seniors and Principal Mike May. And the seniors want to tell us a little bit about a project they do for their senior class. So Ben's going to start off. Ben, tell us about your project. My name is Benjamin Mack. Mm -hmm. I'm a senior. And my project is Other Paths. And what we do is we travel to Africa and help out. All right, really? cool. So, yeah. all right. so his project is taking him all the way to Africa. That's awesome. Savannah. Um, my project is working at Square Little, so I'll be working with students in after school programs and help kids in the class. All right, okay. Cool. Mariana. So I'm going to be working at the APD, at the Albuquerque Police Department, and I'm still not sure what I'm going to do, but we're going to do different things, like outdoor and indoor things. Like I'm going to learn how to like write reports and like just do a lot of police stuff. Awesome. Wow. Ellen, tell us about yours. Ellen. Well, I graduated this May from Miamiville High School, and my senior project was at Enlace Comunitario, and they work towards eliminating domestic violence in the Latino immigrant community. And I personally work with the kids, and we worked on the East Psychotherapy Program, which we did different activities to help them work on their issues at home. Some pretty cool stuff to heavy duty, Ron. I never did anything like this in high school. I, I never did anything like this in high school either. Yeah. So it makes me wonder, Principal May, if you could tell us what does Amy Beal do? So Amy Beal is a charter school in downtown Albuquerque, and our mission is to prepare students for college and for a life of a civically engaged citizen. And we do that by having each of our seniors and all, now our graduates do a year-long project out in the community. Um, they try to find their passion, something they care about, and then they connect that with a community organization. So the goal then is to really link um, what they care about, what the community needs, also with what they're learning. So in addition to working this year-long project, they are also taking two college classes at UNM or CNM that link with their project. So for someone like Ellen, um, Ellen, what were the classes that you took that linked with your project? Uh, I took psychology and <laughs> early childhood multicultural education. Wow. wow. So the goal is that these link thematically, right? That mm -hmm. if, if somebody's in more of a technical area, perhaps the bio park, then they're taking biology classes. But the goal is to give back, to give the students a sense of um, what it means to contribute in their community and then hopefully these folks go on and uh, we know from Amy Beal almost 100% of our graduates go on to college mm -hmm. and they seem to be staying in college at much higher rates than other graduates of New Mexico high schools. All right, almost 100%. Almost 100%. So Mike, may I call you Mike? You may call me. Mike. Oh, all right. <laughs> yeah, <thank you>. so, <laughs> Mike, you know, it seems to me you could be doing a lot of different things. You know, you're very civically minded, obviously, so you could probably be running for Congress right now. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, you look pretty athletic. I bet you could be training for the Olympics right now, maybe a great high jumper. But instead, you're a principal <laughs> here at Amy Beal. Why? Yeah. Um, well, that's a great question. And the Olympics, you know, they, they come every four years, so I still have some time for them. <laughs> um, you know, I think anytime as an educator, when you have an opportunity to work in a school like this, where we have been able to craft a mission that is so meaningful and engaging to students. Um, that really inspires, uh, I think, an individual like me to want to get involved and try to make a difference and help pull that off. So, um, yeah, I, I just really enjoy the, the freedom that we have and also the accountability. Charter schools and Amy Beal have, have said, we want to try to do things a little differently, hopefully with some better outcomes, mm -hmm. not only for these students, but for our community. And I really feel like we're working hard to make that happen at Amy Beal. That's a great awesome. answer. It's a very good answer. Thank you all for joining us today. Thank As you. always, thank you, Ted. Thanks, Ron. Thank you, our adoring audience. We'll Yay. see you next time. Have a great one. Peace. <laughs>